This story is about Angela Bougay, the murder of a five-year-old girl by Larry Graham, who buried her body in a shallow grave. Angela Bougay was five years old when she was kidnapped and murdered in 1983 by Larry Christopher Graham. Her body was found buried in a shallow grave near a body of water in Antioch, California. On November 19, 1983, Angela and her younger brother Chris left their apartment and went to a friend's house nearby to retrieve rain gear. However, when Chris returned home without his sister, their mother, Susan Begay, reported Angela Begay was missing. A week later on November 26, 1983, searchers found Angela's body, Angela Begay, dead, buried near the Contra Loma Reservoir, just several miles away from her home. She was positioned on her side with her pink, leopard, and blue corduroy pants atop of her. Angela was only arrayed in socks, and she was also wearing a white necklace with the word love on it. Her blonde hair was still decorated with a blue ribbon and barrettes. Her remains were transported to the medical examiner's office, where pathologist Louis Daughtery confirmed that Angela had been raped and sodomized before she was strangled to death. Investigators suspected Larry Graham, a former commercial pilot of the killing as he lived in the same apartment complex, had a history of sexual offense against children, and he was the ex-boyfriend of the victim's mother. Susan and Graham began dating after meeting each other at the apartment's swimming pool in the summer 1983. After a few weeks, Graham asked Susan to marry him, but she declined his proposal. She testified that he was the only man she, Angela Begay, was comfortable enough to go willingly with. However, despite their suspicions, Graham was not arrested as there wasn't any evidence linking him to the murder, and they had no confession. The case went unsolved for 13 years until 1996 when investigators obtained a court order to collect a sample of Larry Graham's blood, when the results from the DNA testing revealed that his DNA matched the semen found on Angela's body, he was arrested and booked it to cut into the county jail where he was held without bond. Graham, who was 44 years old at the time of his arrest, was charged with the kidnapping, rape, and murder of Angela Bouquet. Following a three-month trial in October 2002, a Contra Costa County jury found Larry Graham guilty. His defense attorney argued that his dysfunctional upbringing should exclude him from the death penalty. According to the East Bay Times, Graham's mother was an alcoholic and his father had been convicted of child molestation. But that didn't stop a judge from sentencing Larry Graham to death in January 2003. At around 6 p.m. on June 16, 2009, while on death row at San Quentin State Prison, guards found Graham, who was 58 at that time, unresponsive in his cell, according to Fugitive Watch. He was pronounced dead 45 minutes later. Officials stated that his death is being investigated as a suicide. Mm-hmm.